We're very excited at the 5th Innovation Group because we are now able through our offices in Conway and Georgetown to provide microloans to uh, startups and to existing small businesses. Um, microloans have not been available along the Grand Strand prior to this. And what a microloan is, is it is a small loan. In our case, they are loans up to $50,000 that can be awarded through a normal loan process to startups and young businesses who may have been already denied by a bank. The criteria for getting a loan through our affiliation is not as difficult as getting a loan through a bank. In fact, we encourage people that if they are bankable, that they should go to the bank first in order to hold these reserves for people who <clears throat> excuse me, do not qualify um, with a traditional bank. What makes these loans attractive are that um, uh, collateral can be a, is a much broader basis than other loans if it's required at all. Um, the loans can be in very small amounts, as small as five, well, they can actually be, even be below $5,000. But they are set up into two groups. There are what they call startup loans, which are for $5,000 or less and are available for 48 months at a low variable rate. And that's it for people who are just starting a business. So maybe all you have is a business plan, you don't have your financials ready yet, you don't have a brick and mortar if you're, that's the direction you're going, or you're just starting up with, with your web and your software. And it's for developing those sorts of things. It can be for equipment, machinery, um, software development, all of those things that a young business really needs to get it, its first foothold. Um, and then there is a second group called the Micro Business Loan Program. And those are the loans that are up to $50,000. Those are for existing small businesses. And again, it can be for the same types of things. It can be to buy inventory. It can be for working capital, um, lease improvements, whatever sorts of things that your young business needs that perhaps the existing financial structure, financial institutions don't feel is appropriate for them to take a risk on. I mean, these are admittedly riskier loans. So what we have done, because we saw there was such a need in this community for this type of loan for entrepreneurs, is we have partnered with a group out of Greenville called Community Works. And they are very involved in many different segments of the financial uh, enterprises in the Greenville area. But what's most important to us is they also have a credit union, and it's through their credit union that they have obtained SBA funds in order to operate a micro lending program. Um, the reason they are interested in us is because they've recently received an increase in funding and wanted to expand to this part of the state. But uh, an important criteria of these loans is that you have to work with a business developer, which fits great into the wheelhouse for Georgetown and the Conway Innovation Centers because that's what we've been doing right along, is helping people get their businesses off the ground. So if you are approved for a loan through the Micro Business Loan Program, you will then be working with someone from our office, most likely either Kevin or myself or John Kenny down in Georgetown, um, not just to get the money, but to get help getting your business going. And then we have to document back to CW that in fact your business is moving along. Contact me through uh, my email here at the center, which is jsilverman at cicinnovation.com, or they can go to the Georgetown office or work with the Georgetown office. And to do that, you contact John Kenny at gicinnovation.com. In addition, if you go to our website, any of our three websites, the 5T website, the CIC website or the GIC website, there will be a link there to Community Works, and you can go right online and read about the program, and you can actually fill out the application online. 
And if you're comfortable doing that, that's great. Go ahead, make the application. Um, but then you might want to get with us because, of course, like anything else, there's follow-up procedures. There'll be additional documentation required depending on the nature of the loan. But by all means, you can go in and make your application first and then give one of us a call or an email.